And today I'm here to release our 26th annual toy uh, safety report, Trouble in Toyland. And one of the things we recommend for parents is to use something slightly bigger than the test cylinder that everybody has at home, a toilet paper roll. And if uh, a toy moves through the toilet paper roll, like this dinosaur, it's probably unsafe for your ch child or could potentially lead to a choking hazard. One of, the, one of the toys that we uh, found too much lead in was this innocent looking book we found at a major retailer. And it has uh, basically 720 parts per million lead. And if a child was to chew on it, touch it, rub on it, that could potentially uh, cause problems. We found that the funny glasses had 42,000 parts per million of phthalates. So the funny glasses have a chemical that causes reproductive disorders. Not so funny. Uh, the National Institute on Deafness and Other Communications Disorders uh, advises that prolonged exposure to noise above 85 decibels will cause gradual hearing loss in any age. And I'll, I'll demonstrate it just so you can hear just how loud this is. Policymakers should resist efforts by powerful special interests to weaken the CPSIA and the different uh, safety measures that were put in place several years ago. Uh, we cannot and must not weaken the laws that safeguard and protect our uh, smallest consumers. For parents who are about to embark on their holiday season uh, shopping, you know, we want to make sure they know that this, you know, the, the toys in the report and on our website are represent a small sample of the toy hazards. They still need to be aware and um, examine toys carefully. They should also report unsafe toys to the CPSC, and they should use our website, toysafety.mobi.